Astronomers have detected the violent collision of two neutron stars about 4.6 billion years ago. The event could have birthed plutonium on Earth. In 2017, observatories around the world observed a high-energy collision between a pair of dense objects. They were each slightly more massive than the Sun, but only the size of a city. The event confirmed the long-held theory that kilonovas produced heavy elements in the universe, including gold and silver. Astrophysicist Imre Bartos of the University of Florida and Sabol Chmarka from Columbia University have identified a similar collision. It took place back when the solar system was nothing but a gas cloud. The cosmic event has led to the formation of some of the most valuable matter on Earth. It gave birth to 0.3% of the Earth's heaviest elements, including gold, platinum, and uranium, according to a paper appearing in the May 2nd issue of Nature. Bartos explained that in each of us we would find an eyelash worth of these elements, mostly in the form of iodine, which is essential to life. He says a wedding ring, which expresses a deep human connection, is also a connection to our cosmic past, predating humanity and the formation of Earth itself, with about 10 milligrams of it likely having formed 4.6 billion years ago. The researchers estimate that the cosmic collision happened about 100 million years before the formation of Earth. The event took place around 1,000 light years away. If a comparable event happened today at a similar distance from the solar system, the ensuing radiation could outshine the entire night sky. Their calculation suggests this one event produced 70% of curium-247 and 40% of plutonium-244. Bartos now wants to look at other radioactive elements to better understand when and where the neutron star collision occurred. The researchers say that their study provides insight into understanding the origin and composition of our solar system. Scientists are sure that this will also initiate a new type of quests within disciplines, such as chemistry, biology, and geology, to solve the cosmic puzzle.